Hello everyone. So can you listen to Pandora in offline? So they have something like offline mode and downloads features. So offline mode, the feature that they offer to subscribers, you can listen without Wi-Fi or cell network signal. Uh, yeah, but it's only available to Pandora Plus, Pandora Premium or Pandora F Premium family subscribers and only from iOS, Android mobile devices, Apple Watch and Fitbits. Uh, so there you have it. So let's go through. So for Pandora Plus uh, subscribers, the thing is that they can't choose uh, which stations they'd like uh, available for offline listening. Instead, Pandora will download up to three of their your most listened to stations as well as your thumbprint radio and make them available on your offline station list. Uh, yep, yeah. Pandora will never use the last. 500 megabytes of storage on your device. Uh, yeah, you can give thumbs up, thumbs down, skip replay while in offline mode. There you have it. Uh, for Pandora Premium Premium Family subscribers, you have the ability to select stations. Uh, yep, yeah, download many songs, album stations, playlists from Pandora's library. Uh, so, how much storage do you need? Offline content can take up to 300, 700 megabytes of device space, depending on the types of stations or albums you listen to. As for example, classical music can take up more space than a pop station. Again, Pandora will never use the last 500 megabytes of storage available. Uh, if your subscription is interrupted, you will lose access to offline connection. Uh, it's not possible to transfer Pandora music collection to an external music library like Apple Music. Uh, so it depends. Uh, so for Pandora Plus subscribers, uh, Pandora will automatically download three of your most listened to stations to get you started, as well as some print radio. Pandora Premium and Premium Family members, you can just go to my collection and click the download button. It's not possible to download podcasts. Uh, yep. Uh, you can uh, enable or disable offline mode. You can check out your download settings and you can remove all downloads. So there you have it, guys. Hope it's helpful.